What's up everybody, Chris from Florida here. Let's talk about 2024 Camaro production and how scary it really looked. Let's get into it. Let's start with the good. The good is GM is gonna to try to produce as many V8s as they possibly can. The reason that they increase the allocations of up to 60% is because they're gonna to try to get as many V8s built. And people that are sitting here criticizing GM, I've criticized GM many times, but I do say, I think they are trying to build as many Camaros as possible, and especially the V8s. I don't think that it's a case of like, oh, they don't care about the car. I think they do. I think the problem is they have to work with whatever they have. And people criticizing that all oh, the panther edition is just a sticker and paint package which is true typical gm but what are they going to do for a car that's nearly 10 years old a platform that's over 10 years old they're not going to invest that much money into it because it sells on its own if i put some serious money into a platform that they're going to our car that they are going to sell regardless same with corvette they were going to originally refresh the interior this year they didn't because it's still going to sell this is the absolute worst and this is what's scary there is the negotiations for the union contracts coming up the contract end in September. If anyone remembers, there was a strike in 2019 and it really affected Camaro for COVID. Production was stopped for six weeks. That was for a full model run and look how many 2020 Camaros were actually built. I'll take that into account. This is a half of the production year. There's an asterisk next to it because it is possible because GM does it. They do push back productions to get the last amount of orders filled. It depends if they have the parts for it. Still, it's not going to be a full year production. They're going to be trying their best to get them out but if there's a six week strike man i hate to say it if this completely goes south i don't think there's gonna be a single person besides a few collector's editions the zl1 collector's editions and some of the special the new colors are gonna get built and gm needs to get their shit together the union needs to get their shit together because if they don't no one's getting a car positive outcome is within the next month they the negotiations go well they get their shit together and the car production goes as planned and gm really does build more Camaro V8s than they did before. Thanks guys, thank you for watching. See you later.